Sinspalundalsificum, also known as the miracle fruit, is a plant with a berry that when eaten, causes sour foods subsequently consumed to taste sweet. This effect is due to miraculin, which is used commercially as a sugar substitute. Common names for this species and its berry include miracle fruit, miracle berry, miraculous berry, sweet berry, and in West Africa, where the species originates, Egbeon, Tami, Azia, and Lididi. The berry itself is a low sugar content and a mildly sweet tang. It contains a glycoprotein molecule, with some trailing carbohydrate chains, called miraculin. When the fleshy part of the fruit is eaten, this molecule binds to the tongue's taste buds, causing sour foods to taste sweet. At neutral pH, miraculin binds and blocks the receptors, but at low pH miraculin binds protons and becomes able to activate the sweet receptors, resulting in the perception of sweet taste. This effect lasts until the protein is washed away by saliva. The names Miracle Fruit and Miracle Berry are shared by Gymnema sylvester and Thaumatococcus danula, which are two other species of plant used to alter the perceived sweetness of foods. History The berry has been used in West Africa since at least the 18th century, when European explorer Chevalier des Marques, who searched for many different fruits during a 1725 excursion to its native West Africa, provided an account of its use there. Marques noticed that local people picked the berry from shrubs and chewed it before meals. In the USA, an attempt was made in the 1970s to commercialize the ability of the fruit to turn on sweet foods into sweet foods without a caloric penalty, but ended in failure when the U.S. Food and Drug Administration classified the berry as a food additive. There were controversial circumstances with accusations that the project was sabotaged and the research burgled by the sugar industry to prevent loss of business caused by a drop in the need for sugar. The FDA has denied that pressure was put on it by the sugar industry. Similar arguments are noted for the FDA's regulation on stevia now labeled as a dietary supplement instead of a sweetener. For a time in the 1970s, U.S. dietaries could purchase a pill form of miraculin. The idea of the Miraculin Party was conceived then. This phenomenon has enjoyed some revival in food tasting events, referred to as flavor tripping parties by some. The tasters consume sour and bitter foods, such as lemons, radishes, pickles, hot sauce, and beer, to experience the taste changes. Characteristics It is a shrub that grows between 6 to 15 feet in height and has dense foliage. Its leaves are 5 a euro 10 a cm long, 2-3.7 a cm wide and glabrous below. They are clustered at the ends of the branchlets. The flowers are brown. It carries red, 2 a cm long fruits. Each fruit contains one seed. Cultivation. The plant grows best in soils with a pH as low as 4.5 to 5.8, in an environment free from frost and in partial shade with high humidity. It is tolerant of drought, full sunshine and slopes. The seeds need 14 to 21 days to germinate. A spacing of 4 m between plants is suggested. The plants first bear fruit after growing for approximately 3 euro 4 years, and produce 2 crops per year, after the end of the rainy season. This evergreen plant produces small, red berries, while white flowers are produced for many months of the year. The seeds are about the size of coffee beans. In Africa, leaves are attacked by Lepidopterus larvae, and fruits are infested with larvae of fruit flies. The fungus Rigidopterus microporus has been found on this plant. Miraculin is now being produced by transgenic tomato plants. Uses In tropical West Africa, where this species originates, the fruit pulp is used to sweeten palm wine. Historically, it was also used to improve the flavor of soured cornbread. Attempts have been made to create a commercial sweetener from the fruit, with an idea of developing this for patients with diabetes. Fruit cultivators also report a small demand from cancer patients, because the fruit allegedly counteracts a metallic taste in the mouth that may be one of the many side effects of chemotherapy. This claim has not been researched scientifically, though in late 2008, an oncologist at Mount Sinai Medical Center in Miami, Florida, began a study, and by March 2009, had filed an investigational new drug application with the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. 
In Japan, miracle fruit is popular among patients with diabetes and dieters. The shelf life of the fresh fruits is only 2 a year or 3 days. Because miraculin is denatured by heating, the pulp must be preserved without heating for commercial use. Freeze-dried pulp is available in granules or in tablets, and has a shelf life of 10 to 18 months. References External links, Miracle Fruit Facts Archived from the original on December 3, 2007 are from the California Rare Fruit Growers, The Fruit Hunters, author Adam Leith Golner on the politics of fruit and the secret history of the Miracle Berry. Democracy Now! July 9, 2008 Retrieved March 25, 2009 A. A. Euro E. Riding a Flavor Trip Tasting a berry that rewires taste buds a euro The New York Times. Video. May 27, 2008. Human sweet taste receptor mediates acid-induced sweetness of miraculin. Kwazumi AAL. Procnatal Akadsai USA. October 4, 2011. 108, 40, 16819 24. EPUB September 26, 2011. Cortical representation of taste modifying action of miracle fruit in humans. Yamamoto CAL. Neuroimage 2006 Dec. 33, 4, 1145 51. EPUB October 3, 2006.